Uh, a dragon route is basically there's these routes in the game that <clears throat> I call them dragon routes because they're half drag half in. and half in. So let's show you why a dragon route is a dragon route. Go, you got it, you got it in that gun normal. Got the gun normal. Remember? Gun normal had one. <clears throat> is that play, is the Broncos play? X under. Doesn't look like it's a drag route, but it But is. it is. Ready, so if I call this play, it's a dragon route on the left. X. If I call it drag, he's gonna get pressed. So he gets pressed when, he, when you drag him. And if I call an in, that's good. But an in won't get pressed, but it requires route running. So Coates route running is going to factor in against Sheed's man coverage. Mm -hmm. And that I may want that, I may not want that. Depending on Antonio Brown versus Sheed, yes. But Antonio Brown versus Sherman, eh, I prefer not to. Dragon routes don't get pressed. That's where the in comes from. And then they don't require route running that I can tell because they don't really have a cut. They don't have a sharp cut. So you get the best of an in and then you're going to burn your defender. So they beat man really well. Uh, they get good depth. They mostly don't get pressed, and that's why I love dragon rounds. And they're not, and it's not spelled drag like on drag on. It's drag in, drag in, drag in, routes. drag in routes. So those are uh, pretty good to try out.